Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is the day that I'm going into Newark to go serve the poor with the Solidarity Path Project. My family and I are going and we're really excited and I think this is going to be a really great experience for myself and help me realize how privileged I am and the things that I can do to help the people who don't get the opportunities that I get or even they don't get to have food, water, shelter every day like I do. So we're driving to Newark now, but unfortunately I don't think I'm going to be able to take out my phone to record any videos or anything of me helping the poor, but I'll make sure to take pictures and insert them in once I'm done. So we just finished, and it was a really great experience that I had. Um, I was with my sister, and we were both giving like um, drinks to the poor. I gave coffee, she was filling up um, cups with juice. And all the people who were getting the drinks were very appreciative of our help and they made sure to thank us every time. So I'm going to tell you guys a little bit about like how it went. So in the beginning we got there and we helped to set up like the tables with the food, clothing, and the drinks underneath like tents. Um, so for the clothing, there was just a whole bunch of clothing that people brought um, or donated. Um, we brought some of the clothing and I know some of the other contributors brought some of the clothing as well. And then for the food, there were sandwiches, granola bars, crumb cakes, and like fruit and fruit cups. And then for the drinks, there was waters, apple juice, orange juice, and coffee. This was definitely very successful because there was a long line of people and they all seemed to know the founder, Regina, because she is so helpful and very dedicated to her work and always helping her community. So I had a really great experience and there was one man who actually he got the clothing, the food and the coffee and after I gave him his coffee he said that he was so thankful for our help and without us he would be like starving and he was just so grateful that we were able to take the time out of our day to put his him and his community first and serve them so that way they can enjoy the things that we get to enjoy every day. Okay, so I'm going to insert some pictures of what I did here. And overall, I had a really, really amazing experience. And it made me realize so much, like, how privileged I am. And the things that I can do to help others, like the poor. Because they don't get to experience the same things that I do every day. And it's really important to them. And it's just the little things that matter. It's not even... It's just taking like a few hours out of my day to go serve the poor, which is really important because it shows how thankful I am for them no matter the, their life journey. So I was searching up other organizations that I can help out with that would benefit the poor, and I found one which is also in Newark called the Mercy House, and I could hold food drives or clothing drives and bring it to the Mercy House, and I think it would really benefit them because it's an organization that helps like people who can't afford certain things like um, food and water and even clothing and stuff like single parents, uh, families, individuals and all that. So I think that this would be a very good opportunity for me and I would really enjoy helping out with the Mercy House in the future. Thanks for watching.